What's happening out there, everybody? Y'all know who it is. Today has been a good, wonderful day. I tell you that much. Like I said, also Jerry got rid of the rims, man. And second thoughts coming to my brains, man. I want to go ahead and get rid of the stereo equipment that I have. That came out the dot mobile. Um, I got the car sitting in the front of the house now. Got a for sale sign inside the window. Um. You know, I'm just trying to get what I want to get out of the car. Uh, I'm not going by what other people say about the car, uh, how much I can get out of it and stuff like that. You know, I want to get what I want to get out of my own car. You know, that way it take care the one bill out the way. You know what I'm saying? So once I get that one bill out the way, everything is good. You know, I still got the uh, credit people still working on my credit, you know. Uh, we talked last night about that, you know, and trying to lock off a lot of different stuff on there that we can knock off, you know. And, you know, first thing came to my mind about with that credit thing, you know, I want to get out there and buy me another house, okay. So for me to buy another house, I will have to get my credit score up to at least about eight or nine maybe to feel comfortable with it. And then I can go ahead and get me another house. You know what I'm saying? So, that's my goal with my credit line. You know, as far as by getting a car. I still want to get my car and everything, you know. Seven Pilot was okay and everything. But, you know, it wasn't it wasn't really for me right now. Okay? So, I am think I'm just going to continue shopping around. You know, looking. A lot of people telling me go ahead and get the Cadillac and stuff like that, you know. I don't mind having that Cadillac, man, but the Cadillac burns so much gas, man. I can put $20 in there, and it don't only give me five gallons of gas. <laughs> That's messed up, right? $20 give you five gallons of gas in that Cadillac. And that Cal that gas be gone in that Cadillac less than two hours. So that's a lot of drinking and gas, you know, just driving around in town. You know, but I know she uh, saved gas on the highway and stuff like that. But as far as driving around in town all the time, you're going to burn a lot of gas in that Cadillac. And, man, I got to shut this door. Somebody's burning something out here. I don't like the smell of it. But anyway, you know, I'm in the dock mobile now. As y'all see, uh, the stereo equipment I put back in there, the old system I put back in. You know, it's cleaned out real good, you know, inside of it. The outside, I just got to work on. You know, right now, you know, we're supposed to be getting a little rain. Um, it looked like it was going to rain today anyway, so I decided not to go ahead and wash the cars, you know, both of them. Get them back straight now, looking good, you know, because I want to work on that Cadillac, getting that uh, 100% out the way. Okay, so the Cadillac will begin done tomorrow, and the dot mobile will begin cleaned up too. Only thing I got to do is wash it down real good, you know, and dry it off, and she's good to go. You know, she got that shine in the paint job, just like the Kellogg does, you know. When I put the buffers on both of them, you know, so they look good. But I wish I could run that buffer every single day, man. Um, I can't, really, because I be having so much to do every day, you know, without trying to do somebody else's cars and stuff like that, so... Uh, if I do decide to do something like that, I'm going to do it on the weekend. You know, just the weekends only, you know, just go in the hand, uh, put a car in my garage and go to work on it, you know. Ain't going to take long to do it, you know. It might take a couple hours to do it for me, uh, to do a buff job anyway on, on any car. So to make sure it's right. So once I get done buffing it out, you know, you still got to do that pre-wipe down and stuff and then you want to. Put the good stuff on there to shine and stuff, you know, make it look pretty and everything and and let it go. You know, once you get all that stuff done, you still got the windows, you got the tires, you know, you got the wheel wheels to clean and all that stuff. Uh, the chrome, if it got chrome on it or something like that, you know, um, especially like with the red top on the Cadillac, you know, I got a roller, you know, I can roll all the lint off of it and stuff like that, make sure there's nothing on top of that bad boy after I get done with it, you know, it look 100% better, and the Cadillac is up for sale for 7500 so, uh, I'm going to see what I can do with the boss man and see how much he uh, charge me for the car to get it, 
Um, I don't know if it go go along with a payment plan with me with that, you know, to pay it off. I don't know. But, you know, I want mine, you know, because, you know, most of you guys out there told me, hey, hey, lawsuit, Jerry, go for the Cadillac. And that's been on my mind ever since. It's going for that Cadillac. But, man, I had to use that premium gas in there, man. I had to use that second, that one that's in the middle. I had to use the one in the middle. And to put that gas in that gas tank, man, and gas is $3 and 59 cents a gallon, man. And with that $20, it only gave me 5 gallons. If I go with that cheap gas, it probably would have gave me 10 gallons. But it only gave me 5 out of that 20. So, that's the big thing about that. As far as putting gas in, it ain't no problem. You know, but you don't want to drive around just in town and burn up a full tank of gas less than three days, you know. And that'll mess me up really bad by doing that. But, um... I've been treating the car just like it's mine, you know. Uh, I don't get on the gas hard at all, you know. I don't play around with it, you know. I don't hit the brakes hard. I don't get close to nobody. When somebody get close to me, you know, I got to get out the way, you know. So, I don't want nobody touching against it. So, um, the guy that came by yesterday that bought the rims from me yesterday, he might want to buy the dot mobile, uh, just like I told him. Give me three grand, you know, and the car is yours, you know. He said he can get it fixed cheaper somewhere. So, uh, just give me the three grand. I can go ahead and take care of my business out there, you know what I'm saying? And be done with it. And the only thing I just have is just the Cadillac, you know what I'm saying? And just pay on the Cadillac once a month, you know, whatever. Or, you know, try to knock off that bill on that, you know. Because uh, I've been having this cat Cadillac almost... I did that when I had it over a month now, and it's going on to the second month. You know, when July hit, that's going to be the second month coming around. So, um, man, I feel good driving that Cadillac. I always said I always want a Cadillac. I'm finally driving one, you know, and I've been having this one for the longest, you know. And, man, you know, there's a lot of good things I can do with this Cadillac if I did have it, you know. I had CJ on 32 about the 100 spokes on the old school, and that's a big, that's a big no-no towards him, you know, when it comes down to me, if I want something from him or something like that, it's always a big no. So, those rims would have been nice on that Cadillac, them 100 spokes, you know, but anyway, if I do get the Cadillac, you know, it would be something different on there, but then again, you got the Vols on there, I keep the Vols on there, but I probably have to change out on the rims and stuff like that, but man. It looks good. The beat Jack Black. I don't like black cars, but this Cadillac is black all the way around, and then it got the gold package on it and stuff like that. So, man, it'd be kind of hard to really touch up with a black Cadillac with gold words, letters that's on it, the symbol, the Cadillac symbol, then uh, you got chrome around uh, the rag and crown, uh, chrome around the, uh, where the license plates are at, and you got the chrome grill. So, that's the only thing about it, you know, you got three different colors in, onto this car. But, um, the wife was asking me, you know, I should go for the Cadillac, you know, she asked me, uh, talk to the boss, see what he think about it, and see if I can get the Cadillac in my hand, you know, and, and do it that way. Just like I said, the Cadillac got 162,000 miles on it, it's a 2004 uh, when you drive the Cadillac, you don't feel the gears changing at all in this Cadillac. It, it rides that smooth. I mean, they change gears like you don't even feel nothing. Especially if you got on the gas a little bit more, you still don't feel it. You know, when I took it to, to uh, Chicago on um, Wednesday, it rolled good up there and back. The AC working nice and good. I don't like running the AC because she would drink gas. You see what I'm saying? So, and that's one reason why I don't even run the air conditioning in that car. You know, he always tell me, run the air conditioning, man. Jerry, just go ahead and run it. Man, I can't stand running the air conditioning then because I know how much gas you're going to drink. So, pretty much, you will have to have that gas tank full at all times. If she ever get on half a tank, it's time to fill it back up. You know what I'm saying? Never let it get under half a tank. Always fill it up. Right now, I got a little bit over half a tank in it right now. Because I don't like driving it every single day. 
All right. So, um, and plus I've been looking out, trying to look for a nice uh, apartment to move into another house. So we found one of those today, but the house won't be available on until uh, the 8th of July. So I'm hoping that I end up getting the family out of this little shack and move into a better place, you know. So I've been trying to work on that today, too. So we've been moving around a whole lot today and trying to get a lot of stuff done. So I got the wife in the house. We finna get ready to go to the Taste of Joliet. You know, that when we got out here, you know, a lot of eating out there and stuff. And put the kids on some rides and stuff like that, you know. But um, I will have to get my wife in the wheelchair. I'm not going to let her do no walking. I will have to push her around through the park over there at the stadium. So that's where we have our fireworks out there at the stadium. So uh, it's, it's pretty big, you know. It got a nice uh, baseball field, football field, you know, track, uh, golfing and stuff like that. So it's pretty big out there. So uh, right now I'm feeling a little chilly out, but I'm going to still get her a sweater, a jacket to put on. You know, I don't want her to get sick at all when I take over here and stuff. But then again, uh, it's always there for tomorrow and Sunday too. So uh, if I change my mind, we might go tomorrow or Cause Sunday they got a, a picnic going on at their church and stuff on Sunday, so uh, one of the church members guys asked me that would I like to come? You know, I told him I'd be there. You know, so I'd be there on Sunday. You know, and have a little nice picnic with the family and stuff like that. All right. So, um, man, only thing I like to say is um, you guys out there have been helping me out a whole lot. You know, man. I've been trying to think back and forth, back and forth, what I should do with the car, what I should do with the Cadillac, you know. Um, you know, I think I'm going to go forward with the Cadillac. You know, I'm tired of going to a dealership, you know, it's best to get with my old boss, uh, Mr. Roy Finley, you know, get with him and see if I can go ahead and take this Cadillac off his hand, you know, and and do what I want to do because... If he wanted his car like back, he would have called me up and said, Hey, Jerry, I need my car back, you know, and it ain't been none of that, you know. It was like, hey, bring the car like up to me for a second. Let me take another look at it, you know, and blah, blah, blah. And he said, if you want to go ahead and sell the car like Jerry, sell it. But he's telling, he's giving me a big hint. He's pretty much saying, Jerry, you want the car like, you can go ahead and get the car like. You see what I'm saying? So just like I said, I treat it like it's my own. And I, Check underneath the hood, make sure the oil is okay. That was still okay. Only thing that was low on the car was the power steering fluid on that Cadillac. And I tapped that off because I got plenty uh, power steering fluid in the garage. I got oil in the garage. I got uh, cooling uh, interfreeze stuff to put in the cooling system. I got that stuff in my garage. You know, I always kept a lot of stuff in there just in case if my cars went low on something, you know, because you never know. You got to have some just in case. Light bulb, headlights, you know. You got to have all that stuff. Because I didn't want to take no chances with getting pulled over with one brake light or one headlight. And I got it inside my garage. I used to have it inside the dump mobile, but I took everything out the dump mobile and I put everything inside the garage and put it away. Okay, so um, right now I'm going to get up over here, man. But just like I said, if I get ready to go ahead and buy this Cadillac, I'm going to talk to him tonight. And see what he said about it. If so, I'm going to let you guys know. Uh, the whole nine yard. So, you know, the price, what he want for it. You know, I I got to respect that. If it come down cheaper on that, then that's fine, you know. But it's on him, you know, because it's just like me. I want 3000 for my car. You know, if he wants the 7000 for him, for his car, you know, that's what I'm going to give for it, you know. And I don't mind. I need something that I can get in, go to work, go to the stores, go to the doctor's office and stuff like that. Take the girls where they need to go. And I'm okay with that. You see what I'm saying? I'll be happy with that. But pulling out the dot mobile, no, I'm not going to do that. I drove the dot mobile earlier today. She rolled good. First, second, third gear. Got into drive. She rolled good with no problem. But right now... She's going to stay in front of this house with that for sale sign in the window. If they want to call me, they can call me and I tell them exactly what's going on with the car. I give them all the paperwork that I had done to the car. Everything that's been renewed on the car. So, during this year, the 2019. So, 
If they want every report on it, they got it. So I'm not going to hold nothing back. 3000 out the door. I'm fine. I'm happy with it. See what I'm saying? So Lawson Jerry going to get on off of here and um, get the wife out the house, take out and for a nice cruise or something and probably stop somewhere and get some ice cream or something, you know, and and relax, you know, because, uh, man, I've been in the house all week long, man, and it's time for me to get on up, <laughs> get out the house for a minute and do some little things, you know, because sitting up in the house watching TV is cool, but it's time for me to get out and have a little fun, you know, with the wifey wife, you know, and with the rest of the family. So I'm going to give the girls a holler up and say, hey, y'all want to go for a ride? Let's go for a ride. Let's go get some ice cream or something, you know, and and let's have a nice good old night out for a minute, you know, and then we can do the same thing tomorrow. So I'm trying to get the chance to get the girls up to Great America, you know, get up there, get on some roller coaster rides and stuff like that, you know. The wife can't get on roller coaster rides anymore, so I have to ride, uh, walk her around the park and stuff. She'll feel better with that, you know, if I can put on a choo-choo train or something like that, or uh, I can't put on the boat rides, you know, uh, the ones that come down the splash in the water, you know, I can't put on one of those, so um, all the low rides that stays on the ground, you know, I can probably put on something like that, so uh, also Jay going to try and do something with the wife and the kids uh, before time for school to start back up and before I get go back to work or whatever. So, I'm going to try and do something with the family. If I have to get in the car and go out of town somewhere, that's what we're going to do. But I would like to get out there to Philadelphia again and drive out that way. Uh, my brother stays out that way. Uh got cousins and aunties that stay out there in uh, Phoenix, Arizona. So, I'm trying to find a way if I can get up out of here and just take a nice road trip up out of here, you know, before everybody decides to go back to school. So, I don't mind driving it. Uh, and you ain't no need to put the wife on the plane in her condition right now. So, um, it'd be best if I just drive, you know. We know our way around pretty good. So, we just need to get in a car, a newer car, rent a car, whatever, and just go for a minute, you know, and then come on back. So, 32 games, lost to Jerry here, going to get on off. Like I said, I don't say that about three times. But anyway, y'all my true family out there, man. Uh, love every last one of y'all out there, man, from coming to the Lost to Jerry channel, man. I appreciate y'all. Uh, I know y'all don't like for me to do videos, just sit here and talk, yak, 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 you know. But, you know, a lot of stuff been going through my mind. I've been trying to take care of a lot of other stuff, you know. Don't worry, you know. But every time I go to CJ's channel, Lost with Jerry's doing something different with him, you know. But uh, I think I need CJ on 32 to come to Lost with Jerry's channel. You know what I'm saying? And I need you guys to get in the conversation. Let me know. So CJ on 32 come to Lost with Jerry's channel. Me, I say 100%, yes, he should come to my channel, uh, do a couple videos on Lost with Jerry YouTube channel, all right, and, um, and help me out for a minute, all right, so I appreciate him if he did do that for me, I know he will, so I will be um, calling him up tomorrow, he won't be at the shop tomorrow, but he's off on the weekend, so I will be calling him up and see if I can hook up with him, okay, and then, um, that's the only person I'm really looking for. And plus, I ran to Stunner Reese yesterday, Muscle Cars yesterday, with his uh, old school yesterday. He ain't had really time to talk to me, but for a few seconds, he got on the highway and he went home. So, uh, I was, that was pretty cool to run into him, you know, yesterday. And, man, that made my day when I saw him, you know. And I gave Stunner Reese a handshake and a hug, you know, man. And uh, that dude just... He bring out the lawsuit, Jerry, man. When I see, when I run into him, man, he he's he's a hundred percent guy, man. I'm telling you. And uh, between him and CJ, they all good people. All right. As far as I've been knowing, doing last year and this year, two good peoples, man. I want you to go to their channels, watch their videos, man. Stun and Reese don't put up two videos already. Uh, CJ on thirty two put up uh, one today. 
And I think you guys ought to check out that video. Most of you people probably don't seen it already, but the ones that haven't seen it, go ahead and check it out. But I need you guys to go ahead and subscribe to my channel, man. Hit that notification bell. Leave me a nice comment. Thumbs up. And um, help me help lost with Jerry to get to that. I need at least about 3K more. All right? 3K more. And I'd be good. I'd be happy. I'd be satisfied, man. And get that 3K up, man, because I'm at... <laughs> What, seven? So, I need 3K more. You know what I'm saying? Help me get up to that 3K. And it's all good. I would have got paid off of YouTube today, but I couldn't get paid because it was somebody about the username and the password that I couldn't get in. So, I would have to find a way to reset all of that stuff and and get it done. And then, by the time I get this all done, man, i probably have a million dollars in there. You know, just like CJ said, I might have a million dollars up in there or something. By the time I get all this taken care of, but just like I said, I'm gonna find somebody to help me out with this to help me reset the uh, username, password, and and get this all done for lawsuit Jerry can get paid off of YouTube because uh, I can't get no money until I get all that set. And it's been what three months I ain't been paid off of YouTube because uh, I haven't got that all set up. But uh, shout out to Arthur L. He helped me out with uh, my W-2s on there today, you know. Got that out the way and stuff like that. Between him and CJ on 32, they helped me out with that today. And, uh, man, if anybody know how to reset that, let me know. Because I would like to know how to reset that. And that way I can get everything sent over to my account and be done with it. All right? So that's the only problem that I have right now. But, you know. That 3K is what I'm looking for, and everything will be all right, all right? So, um, I'd like to shout out to my homeboy, E.E., -E. you know, Joanne, uh, who else, uh, Big Ron, he comes on my channel, Catfish, homeboy, you know, I mean, man. Pope 815, can't forget about my homeboy, <laughs> so uh, Pope been busy, you know, he got a contract going on out there, he's working on uh, a building or a house or some, somewhere, but he's doing his thing out there, so he's making his money, any way he goes, you know, so uh, Pope 815 is a good, good, good friend, he's a young guy, but he, he's all good, you know what I'm saying, so he's, he's doing his thing out there. And plus, he got a baby on the way, a new baby on the way. So, don't forget to do a shout-out for, uh, uh, go to uh, Pope's 815's uh, YouTube channel. And congratulate him on that. You know, got a baby on the way. So, lots of Jerry's done with babies, kids. You know, I got two. I don't need no more. I'm good. Mine's just about done with high school. I'll be happy when it's over. <laughs> but anyway, Lost to Jerry got to go, just like I said, all right? 32 game, Lost to Jerry, president of uh, 32 game. Lost to Jerry will check you guys out later. When I get that Cadillac, I will tune back in, all right? Peace. I'm out.